We were just talking about bands and shit. But we have decided to move on. Yeah, we just, on yeah, I want to move on, yeah. So what have you been doing? What, what have you been doing this week? What have I been doing this week, Sam? the last week's podcast, isn't it? Mm. It's been an anti-climax, to be honest. Um, Monday, I, as I said earlier, I got team vote of two. Played that. Tuesday, Tuesday, I found out I had an interview, a uni interview in, uh, in, uh, where was I? Glamorgan, that's the place, Glamorgan. Glamorgan. I'm gonna go. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna go. You know, I'm gonna go there. Even though, even though my heart is set on Swansea, like, but I'm, I'm still gonna go there just to see what the campus is like. And the hat has come back on, and he doesn't look like a complete retard. Thank you. Thank you so much. Anyway, um, oh, where are we sitting then? Well, tomorrow, well, I don't know, when's this going up? Well, I'm uploading part five now, so this is part six. This will probably be up by, um, uh, Monday. Oh, well, that really just throws everything out of proportion and perspective. Because, well, let's just say Saturday I went out to the rugby. Wales won, and we all got pissed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I'm going to look like a complete retard if we lose now. <laughs> Who are we playing against? We're playing against Scotland. Oh, then we're not going to lose. We're not going to lose against Scotland. No offence to any Scottish people out there, but your team is shit. Yeah. I'm, sorry, Ollie. I'm sorry. I'm, no, I'm sorry, <laughs> right? I've been watching professional rugby, international rugby now, for about 12 years. And you know, 11, 12 years. Never have I even heard of a team having 90% territory for longer than a couple of minutes. Mm. Yet France had 90% territory over Scotland for the first 10 minutes of the second half. It's diabolical, really. Yeah, fucking good team. France, no. Scotland. I was talking, I was talking um, to, to um, Mega Dave, or the, as he calls him, Evil Gypsy Gemo. Evil Gypsy Emo Jesus. Evil Gypsy G- Emo Jesus, uh, while watching the match. Um, I was just like saying rugby is much more of a a, a, a man's game because yeah, I used to think that I used to like football. I used to like football, but then yeah, I used to like football, but don't. But then everything just became all theatrical about it, you know. Oh, it's crap. The um, two minutes into a game, someone will fall over and complain that their back has been broken yeah. by someone who was like six miles away from them. Mm. It's just a lot of diving. It's like I thought it was. I thought it was football, not swimming, not Olympic swimming, not. What other sort of swimming is there? Swimming. Uh, swimming. Yeah, swimming. Deep sea diving. Deep sea diving. Scuba diving. Yeah, uh, I can tell you something now. Footballers these days, they practice a lot of deep sea diving. Yeah. Just take... Just take away the deep sea bit. Can we... Can we can we say a certain footballer's name who was caught? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, I don't, right. I don't think he's going to watch this video. <laughs> he might. And if he does, bad press is good <laughs> press and my YouTube will become famous. <laughs> oh, thank you, John Terry. You said it. I didn't have to say it. Yeah. Well, FA, if you watch this video, how many women? How many women has he had? How many women? How many women? <laughs> how many women has he had off him? He's like the Tiger Woods. Isn't he? <laughs> He's like the Tiger Woods of football. Only he doesn't beat them around. Who's the Tiger Woods of rugby? I wonder. I don't bloody know. Probably Gavin Henson. Yeah, probably Gavin Henson. I mean, <laughs> we've we've been bad mouthing <laughs> many sport icons. <laughs> I mean, Gavin Henson. He wrote an autobiography when he was like twenty. You can't write an autobiography. Can't, I know you can't. It, it would be like me or Jed sitting down to re- write an auto. A lot has happened in our uh, eighteen years. Eighteen years. Eighteen and a half. Eighteen and a half. It does not. Don't get me wrong. You know, but. We wouldn't just sit down and write it. I mean, where would we start? Well, what's the point of writing it? Because, okay, a lot has happened, but a lot is supposed to happen at this point. You'd just be writing about things that most people have been common, have common ground with. Like no, it'd just be like chapter school. one. Uh, I went to primary I school. I went to primary school. Chapter two, I went to secondary school. Nothing. Oh, secondary school and primary school. Ooh, very groundbreaking stuff. I'm, th- I'm thinking that's probably what Gavin Henson probably put in. Yeah, I went to oh, primary school. Gavin Henson was a PE nerd, so he never went to secondary school. Did he? I don't think he would have. Well, I, I, don't think he, I don't think he went to university. <laughs> <laughs> Even if he did go to secondary school, do you think he actually did much there? No, I don't think so. Uh, think so? Think so? Think so? Think so? Think so? Think so? The donkeys are aliens. Um. <laughs> this is a very random 
garage diary. It is a very random I garage don't diary. Suck off a donkey. And that's that's well, that's I guess that's what you expect. You'd expect from someone like me. English lessons are questionable. Questionable for Miss Walter Leo. Miss Walters, yes. Miss Walters likes to be questionable. We we're not even, we're not allowed to mention teachers' names. So that's okay. Mm. Oh well. You you just you just broke the. Uh, oh fuck it. You, yeah. Oh fuck it. Well, how many? Yeah. How many are we on? Well, uh, five minutes. Well, five, well, and five, minutes. five and a half minutes. Right. Um. See, I'm thinking I can get. I'm thinking. Well, I, I'm thinking I could get her. How much after this? Um, no, I'm thinking. Oh, I'm thinking. <laughs> I'm, thinking I'm thinking a poster over there. You know. A poster. Well, what of? Joker. Not too serious. Or by there. If something goes. Wrong. Oh, you could get um. You know that big group, we could get a group photo, get that blown up, and make that a poster here. We could, but, like, we only know, like, 90% of the people in it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a small amount, Jed. <laughs> Ironically, 90% is has, has come up twice so far. It has, and both times for me. Yeah. I I'm... We know you filthy fuckers would prefer 69%, but we 69%. can't. 69%. We can't, we can't say 69%, because that's, 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 that sounds wrong. It just sounds wrong, there's a mathematical inaccuracy. It is, is. You do A-level maths. I, I, I've never seen a statistics question that says 69% of the population does something, because the uh, person sitting in the exam will just go, 69, and then just... Be unable so to that's the that entire question. reason for thinking that the maths examination board has not put 69% on the yeah. question. Because people are inherently childish. People are inherently childish and, uh, you know, they, they like to laugh at things that are sound innuendous. Proves my point exactly. Mm. At this point, if you were laughing and giggling at that little uh, gesture there, you are part of the population who laugh at stat questions would say 69%. Stop it. <laughs> Ronald is coming to visit. <laughs> Why are you laughing at that? Ronald is coming to visit. <laughs> this is like a dangerous thing. This, you should put, uh, not, you shouldn't take, I, uh, yeah. This is a warning. You shouldn't take this as kindly. You shouldn't say to your children, Ronald, Ronald, Ronald is coming, coming to visit. visit. That could be like Especially some... if you do it in that voice because <laughs> Ronald is coming. Yeah, yeah, especially, right? This this should be a warning. This should be put in a police police station. You know. Police station. Police station. A police station should be pinned up saying have you seen this man? Have you seen, and you know, just that bit there. Have you seen this man? He lures little children into his uh, into his empire and, and feeds them and then kills them. Probably. 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 Unless he, 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 he kind of looks like Pennywise, the clown, from uh, It. Say bye, Gingerbeard. Bye, Gingerbeard. Bye. Ronald is coming to visit, by the way. <laughs>